Welcome to Sid's Tips, and today I am so thrilled you're here to join with me to talk about Canva, and one of the very cool features and technology is removing a background from an image, whether it's a person or an item. Now, I had shared the removing of the background with a group of people that are YouTubers, and they didn't even realize that this was available in Canva. So I'm so glad to share this with you, and it's available with the pro version. They have a free version here that you can use. It's great if you've never heard of Canva. You definitely need to check it out. You could design anything with it. And if you do want to check it out, I appreciate you clicking on the link in the description. So let me uh, first uh, share with you, uh, and then we'll dive in. So they have a free version, uh, or you can go with the Pro, which I'm going to be going to. And if you pay for it by year, uh, it's not. It ends up coming out to $9.95 a month, but you're paying that up front. Or you could do monthly at $12.95, and then you can come down here and then see uh, everything of the differences. Obviously, you can go with an enterprise solution, but you're probably going to just go with the Pro. So uh, everything's right there when you come to the site to, to learn the pricing. Now, so this is where I got excited. So uh, normally what I do is I come up and then I uh, type in YouTube and I, I do a thumbnail. So what I do generally now I could easily like move one of these images in here as easy as that. And then there's different components to an image and you can easily just uh, go ahead and uh, do that or you can create your own. So that's what we're going to do. I'm going to go ahead and delete this, but I just wanted to show you where actually you can go back and we're going to remove this all. So now we're starting from scratch. So what you do is you're going to upload your image. You're going to click the uploads. You're going to find the file and then either you can upload it or these are all these different images that I've already uploaded. I've been having a blast. So it all started. Let me find the photo that I uploaded. So is this one right here and I put it in here and then uh, what you do is you wait um, right here. You'll see effect and you'll see then it, it might take a few seconds initially for when you when you load a new photo in for it to then tell you that you can click on the background remover. Now watch this, this is amazing um, with all this detail and it's just me. So you click background remover and within seconds it removes the entire background just like this. Now how awesome is that? I mean truly incredible. And now you uh, have got yourself where you can you know, add that to an image and then you, could, you can easily cr you know, crop it down to what you don't want in there now what's really cool so if you wanted to as a thumbnail they've got other elements in here too so they've got different um, uh, animated icons they also have uh, whatever it might be so if you wanted to do like a, a wow so you could say wow and then you could like put that right there and you can create a really cool like thumbnail, whatever it might be. Again, they've got all different types of artwork that you can work with. Well, if you're gonna do an Instagram post, you can do that with an Instagram post and they have everything precise. So then once you have this uh, set up and then you can also, if you want, you can create like a, a colored background. So very quickly and easily. Uh, they also have all these other type of backgrounds. So if you wanted to, uh, look like you're on a planet you can do that so it's very cool easy to do and then you simply uh, can come up here you could filter adjust crop uh, there's there's so much you can do and then you could download now there's different types of downloads that you can do you could do a PNG you could do a JPEG you could do a PDF uh, you could do an mp4 GIF so there's a, a, a number of different things you can also uh, have it as a transparent background if you want or you just have the the background there as it is and uh, so it's very very cool very easy uh, now let me go back home just to show you so let's just say you wanted to do for Instagram you wanted to do for an Instagram post they'll already have you know the spec size that you want to go with so you can come here once you have your uh, uploads you can come to any any of your your work and you can uh, then and here let's just say I wanted to, to use this this was uh, a 
webcam video that I did the other day, you could do the same thing. Then you go click effect, background remover, and then you could see, I mean, it's truly amazing how it just takes out the entire background, just like that. Now, I'll show you some examples where in some cases it didn't work, but you could see here uh, how well uh, that worked. Now, let me go back home. We'll do it a larger size so you can see clearly because that was a, let me discard that. Um, and now we're gonna go back and we're gonna do, uh, we're gonna do a YouTube, YouTube thumbnail. And just so we have a bigger thing uh, area to work with. So I'm gonna just show you, for example, here, like I wanted to see how this would come out. Uh, and you'll see here, uh, it didn't come out as well. So I'm gonna click effects, background remover. Uh, and in the case here, you could see it didn't fully capture everything uh, there. So it's not 100% perfect. Uh, another one, let's find another one that I tried to do. Uh, this was, I think, another one where it didn't fully work. And I was just having, again, I'm, I've been having so much fun with these backgrounds. And I definitely think it's going to make a difference with my thumbnails that I do for YouTube. And you could see there how it uh, didn't fully capture the item. So I guess it really depends um, what the, the background scene is. This was one that actually worked well, um, and you could see all that dark background. So these are uh, eye patches uh, to help the puffiness reduce. So we're gonna click effect, background remover, and just like that, it's gonna remove the background, and it's amazing. I mean, how awesome is that? And you can see how like, now I really pop. So especially if you're getting into YouTube and thumbnails, you could really make your images pop. And then they also have, which I did for, for this video, I did um, a golden, let's see, a gold arrow. So here's one, and then you could actually move it. And then you could, you know, really get creative with it. So I want to just share this with you. It is awesome. Let me know what you think. Uh, if you're using Canva, did you even know that this was even available amongst many of the other features? I'm really, really thrilled to have learned about this, share it with you. I'll be sharing other types of videos like this. If you find it as a help, by the way, give it a thumbs up and be sure to subscribe to my channel and click that bell icon so you can be notified of new videos as well. So thanks so much. Be sure to click on the link. Really appreciate that. And let me know if you have any questions. Look forward to seeing what you have to say about this, if you knew about it and how it's working for you. Take care, everybody. We'll see you on the next video.